Hey friends, Chef Wainena here, and I hope you're all doing well. Today I'm sharing this chickpea quinoa vegetable stir fry, which is one of my favorite and to go to dishes most of the time. An easy, healthy, and tasty recipe that you can do on any day of the week, and you and your family will definitely enjoy. Let's go ahead and do some peeling and chopping for this delicious recipe. This chickpea quinoa vegetable stir fry is all about getting the best out of simple ingredients. A zucchini, a summer squash, some carrots, bell peppers, an onion, lemon, ginger, garlic, quinoa, canned chickpeas, paprika, oregano, chili powder, dry thyme, cumin, coriander. First things first, we are going to wash this quinoa through running water to remove any dirt that might be there or anything else that is not palatable. Using the same container that we measured the quinoa with, water, about one and three quarter. This is just about the same ratio as you will do rice. A touch salt, cover, bring to a boil, reduce the heat to the lowest, cook for 15 minutes, turn off the heat, let rest for 10 minutes. Open the chickpeas, drain, Set aside after rinsing. With all the knife work done, a good time to go start the cooking. Add cooking oil into the pan. I'm using avocado, you can use any. Add the onions. Carrots goes in. The bell peppers. Season this with salt and pepper. So take these vegetables until they start to caramelize on the edges. You can turn the heat all the way up. This is a dish that comes together very quickly. It's a good side dish and also a good vegetarian. Uh, the quinoa is packed with all the good nutrients. Actually, it's one of my favorite grains uh, besides things like barley, farro, millet. It's a good grain too. They are very healthy. Cover these vegetables for about five minutes just to quicken the process. A 
have been occasionally opening the lid here give these vegetables a stir we can clearly see that they are starting to caramelize the other thing we want to make sure that the carrots are almost cooked through awesome now in no particular order add the spices coriander cumin paprika chili powder thyme dry and dry oregano all the ingredients in this recipe will be in the description box Now a good time to add the chickpeas, the zucchini and the summer squash. Those don't take long. Remember the chickpeas are already cooked. Just a splash of water here. Cover and let those zucchinis finish cooking. Almost forgot my ginger and garlic. Add them at this point. Lead back, let continue cooking. Heat all the way to the lowest some scallions to finish parsley a squeeze of lemon juice olive oil to finish extra virgin olive oil leave just a little bit for finishing at the end Just before the dish goes to the table, add a heaping of the cooked quinoa. Stir it in. I have some quinoa reserved for a future use. I always have quinoa, rice, and any grain that I have always ready cooked and ready to go in the house this looks so good cover let rest for about five minutes for the quinoa to absorb all those good flavors This super delicious dish, the quino has absorbed all these good flavors. Mm. Just have a look at that. Finish this with some of the scallions, parsley, then the remainder of our olive oil. Mm. Some more lemon, then serve with the rest. this dish a test mm. Mm. this is so good mm. 
Mm. Oh wow, what a simple dish with chickpeas, quinoa, lots of vegetables. It's a complete dish all by itself. Makes a perfect vegetarian or actually even a vegan. A perfect side dish has all the nutrients you need. The chickpeas, the quinoa, they are loaded with proteins. The vegetables comes with all those vitamins. A very healthy dish that you can do on any day of the week and you and your family or yourself will definitely enjoy. So thank you so much for watching this one. I hope this is a recipe that you can try in your own kitchen. Uh, put a chicken on top if you want to complement it even more. A piece of fish, salmon or any fish will do and you got yourself this very delicious dish. Thank you again. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Leave me a comment down below. I will see you in the next one. Have a good week.